Hello there ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, welcome back to Elder Scrolls Skyrim. In last episode we spoke to Faringar and gave him our, or not our, but gave him the dragon stone. And now we're here to kill a dragon, so we're just gonna, I'm just gonna wait, uh, like a couple of hours and wait for them to get here. And then I'm hoping that this isn't gonna take up the entire time. No signs of any dragon right now. But it sure looks like he's been here. I know it looks bad, but we've got to figure out what happened. And if that dragon is still skulking around somewhere. Spread out and look for survivors. We need to know what was Hey, watch it! But the entire time that this is gonna take, I hope it doesn't take up the whole ten minutes that I have to record, because that's gonna suck. Alrighty. No, get back. It's still here somewhere. Porky and Tor just got grabbed when they tried to make a run for it. Yeah, Hiroki and... Or, yeah, Hiroki or... Yeah, I think that's what he said. And Tor is supposed to be a Loki and Thor kind of reference. Kind of an easter egg, I guess. Correct. I think you can actually hear him say words like in not like the dragon language or whatever, but you can actually hear him speak. But I don't really know. I think you can hear him talk though. Come on, get down here so I can kill you. Oh crap, we're gonna end up dying. Possibly, I hope not. Oh, I didn't know that poison would work on him. Come on, come on. Yay. Let's make sure that overblown lizard is really dead. It kind of sucks that you don't end up actually hearing him say, Oh, no, Doa Keen. Kind of sucks because I was hoping I would uh, hear that. What's happening? Everybody, get back. I've always found that cool. Dragonborn. Dragonborn, what do you mean? In the very oldest tales, back from when there were still dragons in Skyrim, the Dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. That's what you did, isn't it? Absorb <laughs> the dragon's power. I don't know what happened to me. There's only one way to find out. Try to shout. That would prove it. Alrighty. According to the old legends, only the Dragonborn can shout without training. The way the dragons do. Dragon boy, what are you talking about? All right, give me a minute. That's right. My grandfather used to tell stories about the dragon. Boosh! Sound hey, great mountains. The one with the dragon blood, in it. like old Tiber Septon said. I've never heard of Tiber Septon killing any dragons. There weren't any dragons then, idiot. They are just coming back now for the first time in forever. But the old tales tell of the dragonborn who could kill dragons and steal their power. You must be one. What do you say, Yerlef? You're being awfully quiet. Come on, Yerlef. Tell us. Do you believe in this dragonborn <coughs> business? Hmm. <laughs> Some of you would be better off keeping quiet than flapping your gums on matters you don't know anything about. Here's a dead dragon. And that's something I definitely understand. Now we know we can kill them. But I don't need some mythical dragonborn. Someone who can put down a dragon is more than enough for me. You wouldn't understand, Housecar. You ain't an orc. I've been all across Tamriel. I've seen plenty of things just as outlandish as this. 
I'd advise you all to trust in the strength of your sword arm over tales and legends. That was shouting, what you just did. You must be. You really are Dragonborn, then. Well, I'm gonna go and talk to your Jarl. That's cool. That's really cool, looking at the moon. That's what I've been looking at the entire time, just staring. I don't know, I'm kind of excited for what, uh, whenever Elder Scrolls 6 comes out. I'm hoping it takes place kind of further in the, after the Dragonborn and not, like, in the past. Because if I'm correct, um, uh, actually... But after... Or during the time of Elder Scrolls Skyrim, there's actually a war going on between the Argonians and the uh, Dark Elves. And I'm kind of hoping, like, because it's rumored that it will take place in Argonia. But, or in Black Marsh, but... I kind of hope it's not kind of like that. Like, you're the hero who saves everybody in Black Marsh from the Dark Elves or some, something like that. It could be, but I don't really know. Well, I'll just have to wait and see. We all will, actually. I've never really cared for Elder Scrolls uh, Online. I just never found it to be pretty... Not Well, not pretty fun, but I've never found it to be that fun, really. It's kind of just... kind of It's kind of boring, because it's like a grinding game, basically. So, I, I don't really know. I don't really care much for it. They didn't speak to me. That's weird. Alright, let's get up to Dragon's Reach, and then I'll go and talk to the Arl, or at least, actually I'll go and not, well I'm not going to talk to him, but I'll go up there and speak, uh, or not speak to him, but go up there and end the video and get inside. Dang, I, can, I can't speak today at all. Sorry about that, that I can't really speak all that good right now. Can't get the words to come out correctly, I guess. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be the end of this episode, and the next episode we will talk to the Jarl, and we'll go from there where he wants us to go. Probably go talk to the Greybeard or something like that. Keep spoiling everything, Jesus. Uh, but I apologize for that. I'm pretty sure you guys don't really care. Most of you guys have probably seen the game, or played it. Alrighty, so this is going to be the end of this episode. Uh, leave a like, comment, subscribe, please. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.